Welcome to 11 Live Midday here at 11. I'm Aisha Howard. I'm Christy Diaz and for Cheryl Preheim today. Right now, Atlanta police are investigating a deadly shooting in the Grove Park neighborhood. Ariana Manise joins us live from Northwest Atlanta where police say one person was shot and killed. And Ariana, while police haven't confirmed the victim's identity, you spoke to a woman who says it was her son. That's right, Christy. We spoke to the mom when we first got on the scene this morning. She tells us that it was her 16-year-old that was shot and killed. She says she initially heard those gunshots but never imagined, never thought that it was her son that was killed. A mother's pain. <laughs> so Adricus Brooks says she heard the gunfire that killed her 16-year-old son when she was walking to the store. When I heard the gunshots, it was about 11.40. But... So, what was your son doing outside at 11.40 at night? Never imagined those shots would take her son's life. For one second, I, I don't know what imagined that would be my son. This was the scene on Cato Street in Northwest Atlanta where Brooks says her son was killed. Atlanta police have not confirmed the victim's identity or details surrounding the shooting. Brooks says it was her understanding her son and his friend went to another house in the neighborhood to retrieve a scooter. So they went to another house in the neighborhood to go retrieve a scooter. Did they go to steal somebody's scooter? Or was that scooter theirs? Did that scooter belong to them? That is the question people need to be asking. That is the question. Because surely, I'm pretty sure it was another black person who killed him. Because it doesn't matter what these police officers do. Black folks love killing one another 24 seven, each and every day. And um, so I'm pretty sure they got killed over that scooter. She says she knew something was wrong after he did not come home for several hours. But I didn't get a phone call from my son until about two o'clock. And I just want to come outside that Jiffy Pop bag on her head, looking like, looking like a total mess. I was walking around looking for him so about three something. So he did. He had hours pass past. She says in the moment she could only. They look like the hood. They like the real hood. Only think the worst until they found him. They walked in the woods and seen him. He's the best friend that be in my house. They're like brothers. Brooks tells Eleven Alive her son was the youngest of five and was someone she leaned on. Very smart. And he, and he gave me advice. And so she got five kids staying in that type of environment. That's what I be saying, people. These women are running around here having all these kids and they stay in the hood and they don't want to get away from niggas. The key thing is to get away from niggas that maybe, just maybe, the children might have a better chance of living if they don't get shot up by the police. And he said, Mama, you know, God stagged your blessings for a reason. Cause he said, cause, you know, and I'm like, what is, you know, very wise. Atlanta police say the investigation continues surrounding the fatal shooting. Whatever the situation, what took place about the scooter, whatever, I don't know really the details. It took place by that scooter. Like I just said, either the scooter wasn't his, or they went to somebody's house to go take a scooter, or the scooter was down and there was some sort of altercation with whomever they let borrow the scooter. You know, maybe somebody said, you can get this scooter back, it's mine now. Or they, they want to jump and pop out back, who knows? Of it, but I have a son that's not coming back no more, and I'm not gonna be able to see him. Now, if you look behind me, you'll see Atlanta police are still here on the scene. As of right now, they haven't confirmed if they have any suspects, any persons of interest, or if whether they've made any arrests. Reporting live from Grove Park, I'm Ariana Manese for 11 Alive. That sound like the hood right there, Grove Park. That sound like the hood in Atlanta. Well, as always, the video will be in the description below. I love those who love me. Don't forget you guys, Jesus Christ is King.